Hey, how's it going? Welcome to another video. I am Ezekiel. Today I have with me the Bleak Hummingbird wireless earphones. At a first glance, I must admit that these are one of the most beautifully packaged products I've seen this year. And well, we are about to find out if what's inside these packages lives up to their presentation. As you can see, I have both the black and white variant here with me. They are also available in red if that's more of your style. First of all, let's unbox the white edition and then we'll move on to the black edition and also talk about the sound performance and quality. Opening the box, there is a transparent plastic at the top. Opening that, you've got the earphones themselves planted in this thick foamy material. Putting that aside, uh, then underneath there are lots of accessories. You'll get a bleak sticker, a pack containing a quick start guide, safety information and warranty card. Putting that aside, there are lots of ear tips so you can find the right fit for your ears and they are packaged in a transparent plastic pack as well. And there is also a carrying case which is pretty stylish. It's made of plastic and it's coated with uh, leather all around and it has a magnetic flap for opening and closing it. I really like how it looks and feels in the hand when you consider how much you are paying for this. There is a micro USB charging cable as well. Obviously, these are not USB Type-C earphones, so you have to take notes. I'm sure by now you should have noticed the Bleak logo crested all over each accessory right out of the box. Well, taking a look at the earphones themselves, as you can see, it's made of tough plastic all around with expandable rubber hooks. There is the Bleak Metal logo crested on both sides which gives it a nice premium look. You have the volume rocker buttons which is also used to skip and rewind tracks. By just double clicking the power button you can enter ambient mode which makes you hear sound in your surroundings without having to take off the earphones. Uh, this wasn't the best for me as I heard lots of hissing sound. I just wish it was a little bit clearer but it works anyway. I really like how the buttons protrude out very well so it makes it very easy for you to find the right controls. Once paired with your smartphone or tablet, you can trigger Google Voice Assistant or Siri by triple tapping the power button. If you want to work out while listening to music, they are completely sweat proof so for gym goers and outdoor sport activities, this will do the trick. The battery life is also impressive. One full charge will give you 14.5 hours which is quite a lot for earbuds of this size without a neck band. Now coming to sound performance and quality. First of all, I was pretty impressed with the overall sound output from the drivers of these earphones. Everything sounded so crisp and clear. Vocals are slightly forward while the bass is slightly recessed, especially at low volumes. Its sound reproduction is quite tight and punchy when the earphones are worn properly. So you have to bear that in mind. These are not bass heavy earphones but they possess quality bass that does not overpower the mids and the highs. You definitely don't want to rock these at max volumes as they get pretty loud. You have to also bear in mind there is the lifetime warranty so if anything goes wrong you are covered according to their terms and conditions. They are also really comfortable, you are going to forget that you have them on your ears uh, because they don't really weigh much. There are lots of ear tips so you can find the right fit for your ears. At first, I chose the ones that were already fitted and they didn't really fit very well or reflect the bass. But after I tried out a pair of the bi-flange round ear tips, there was a significant difference in sound quality. I still recommend you take your time and try them all out. There is plenty of choice here. So it's really important to find the perfect fit in order for you to achieve the best balance between comfort and sound quality. Now coming to the black variant, as you can see, it comes with same accessories but in black color. So as I said earlier on, these are one of the most beautifully packaged headphones I've seen this year. Yes, you heard me right. As you can see, the carrying pouch has this black leather. It's also got a red stitching all around, which really looks nice and premium. I really like them. Wearing the black variant, it also looks and feels the same. No change in sound quality or comfort. They sound great and fit properly. Coming to pricing, these come in at between $70 to $80 equivalent. As always, I'll be throwing links down in the description section for you to purchase these. Feel free to check out other nifty gadgets on this channel. Click the red subscribe button and the bell icon to see more videos like this. Thanks so much for watching. I am Ezekiel and I'll talk to you all in the next video. Adios.